Greetings all, Fanny here for Taurus's Daily Oracle Message. Taurus, I hope you're having a good day. Today we're doing the Divine Abundance deck. So we have companionship, giving someone you giving someone your complete presence is an astonishing gift. I love that. And receiving. Every day it becomes a little easier to receive the highest divine plan and to trust your inner guidance. That is a beautiful affirmation and uh, confirmation. Thank you, that was the word that I was looking for. Beautiful confirmation that the work that you have been doing is, is working. Okay, words, please work with me. The work that you have been doing on your soul, surrendering that which no longer serves you, is being affirmed and confirmed that you are doing an incredible thing for yourself right now. You're coming back to the sense of who you are and what you're worth and understanding what you do deserve. And it's going to be easy for you to receive. When you understand that everything that you need will always be provided for you, you will no longer want and you will no longer have that feeling of lack. So allow yourself to grieve. Allow yourself to cry. If you're anything like me, you try to hold it all inside and it becomes very built up. So right now, understand that you are connected to the divine source of infinite love, abundance, peace, and acceptance. So take some time, quiet in meditation, and pull that energy into yourself. Use affirmations. Every day it becomes easier for me to receive and the highest divine plan and trust my inner guidance. It is easy for me to receive. It is easy for me to receive. It is easy for me to receive. Help me know that all my deepest needs will be met. Help, let me trust that you have a plan and the right actions will come. You are my source for all. Detach from that which no longer serves you. Detach from the identity that you no longer abide by. With detachment, you can finally feel whole inside, with or without the fulfillment of a particular desire. Ironically, that is often when it is filled. You know that phrase or that when you're looking for something and it only shows up when you stop looking for it? That is very similar to divine energy. So for I know for myself, I have been a the kind of person that wants to be in a relationship. But it's very difficult for me to get to that point because I have a difficult time trusting people. I have a difficult time opening up to people. And I have a difficult time even being attracted to people and people being attracted to me in return. And so that is always on my mind of when am I going to be with someone? When am I going to meet someone? And I have to move on from that and then, and come back to myself work on myself, my business, and my future, and they'll just like plop out of nowhere whenever that happens. But that is also very difficult for me. Tauruses are very amorous. Of all the earth signs, they are the most physically loving. And I have Taurus not only as my sun sign, but as my Venus sign, and like four other planetary bodies. So I have all of this energy that wants and desires physical affection, but I'm not getting it, so my brain is in a constant loop. So that is something that I have to clear and offer to spirit. And that is something that is in my own path, in my own journey. So you could take that as it resonates for you. Awakening yourself as a life of a spiritual sheep and coming back to the oneness and connection with God and spirit. And this is any God that you can connect to. If your God is Jesus, then that's perfectly fine. I personally don't subscribe to that storyline. I prefer more natural gods. Oh my. You have loss, letting go, and extraordinary. So the loss of the person that you once were, opportunities that you could have had if you had chosen a different path. You might be mourning a life that you didn't even know about. Let that go, my love. It's not serving you. It's only blocking you. Because you are extraordinary and capable of so much potential and beautiful things in this world. There is a wild impetus uniqueness in to you that deserves to be honored. Yes. Live in your authenticity. Live in your beautiful, radiant, dysfunctional light, my love, because you did not come here to be anyone else but who you are. Have a beautiful day.